Where are you coming from, church? <laughs> hey, you got some more tequila back there? Ah. I think I just got another bottle the other day. It should be the good stuff, too. I think it's in the corner. Come on, come on, let's go. Yeah, this man's thirsty. Come on, buddy. So, anyway. <laughs> you might as well have some more. Hey, you got more. Hello, Rich. Hey, babe. I noticed you weren't around last night. Everything okay? I'm sorry, but I'm leaving you. You can't stop me this time. <laughs> That's a loaded statement. I think maybe you should think this through a little bit more. I don't know how you're planning to do this, but you know you can't call the cops. To them, we're just the same. You know what? Just put the ring back on. I can't. You know I love you. Just put the ring back on. I'm sorry. Put the ring back on. No! Put the ring back on. No! Put the fucking ring back on now! Fuck you! God! You fucking bitch! I give you everything, and this is what you do? I guess beating it into you wasn't enough. I'll tell you what. You spit on my face, I carve it into yours. Wait, wait, wait. No, wait, no, please. If you that night you guys any closer, you're fucked. Oh, yeah? Why is that? I brought back up. <laughs> really? You bet. Watch, any minute now, the best bodyguard you've ever seen is gonna come through that door and make you wish you'd never met me. <laughs> no, no, really, I mean it any minute now. <laughs> well then, I guess your man either bailed or he's too late. It's a she. Hey, lady. I'll be right with you in just a minute. Can't you see I'm in the middle of something? I wasn't talking about the drink. I said, it's a she. And for the record, she wasn't late. She was just wondering how far you had the balls to go. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're the bodyguard? And you must be Prince Charming. Your lady friends told me a bit about you. So, here's the deal. You're not gonna lay another finger on the woman, and we never have to speak of this again. Nobody gets hurt, and you save yourself the embarrassment of an ass kicking. <laughs> Do we have a deal or not? You gentlemen want to take care of this situation? I got it. Let's go. Hey! Hey! Let's go! How was that, boss? You better keep your eye on her. <laughs> Cindy, huh? Yep. Ran away from a bad home with her fiance a few years back. But as time's gone on, he's gotten abusive. Very abusive. 
Kind of like a twisted version of Cinderella, huh? I'll pass. What? <laughs> really? That's it? You'll pass? She remind you of anyone we knew? You mean Shelly? I mean, yeah, there's the abusive boyfriend, but I doubt it'll end the same. I'm not saying it will. We don't even know if she's telling the truth. All I'm saying is that it reminds me. Okay, all right, that's fine. Good night. I'll be back soon. Next time we pass by one of those stores, stop by, okay? I'm running low on cigarettes. Yeah, sure thing. Sure though? Yeah, very. You don't wanna try and take this as an opportunity to try and quit again? Why should I? Because it slowly kills you. Yeah, what's so bad about that? Excuse me? I'm just saying that everything slowly kills you, Maya. What's so bad if it's a few cigarettes? Yeah, but they kill you painfully. They hurt you. Hey, Maya. How about you get off my ass or I'm gonna hurt you? Okay. All right, geez. You need to calm down. Are you okay, man? I don't wanna talk about it. Look. I know you like to keep to yourself, but communication is the most important thing there is. Maya! I mean, that's how you build and maintain relationships. Maya, you missed the turn. What? Oh, shit. Sorry. <sighs> Stop the van. I'm walking back. Oh, dude, just relax. We'll take the next- Stop the fucking van! About. Why? Because I'm a fucking piece of shit, that's why. I have one job, Maya. One job, and I couldn't even do that right. That's not true. You want to talk about abusive boyfriends? How about Shelly? Shelly had an abusive boyfriend, and I should have done something. I could have done something, and I didn't. And guess what? She's dead. She killed herself because of me because I wasn't there, because once again, I'm not good enough. Is that what you wanted to hear, Maya? I don't think I ever want to hear that. You know, you weren't the only one that knew. That's different. I know how to fight. It's my job, I'm supposed to be tough. You don't know what it's like to have to look at your friend in the hospital because you were able to fight and you didn't. That's exactly why you can't quit. This lady, Cindy, she needs you. She needs you like Shelly needed us. What are you so afraid of? 
That this lady is lying to you? That you'll lose control? And what if I do? This is what you do. You go in there, you observe, and you wait it out. Just put the ring back on. I'm sorry. See what kind of guy he is. If he's all right, then fine, walk away. But if he lays a hand on her, then there's your second chance. There's your Shelly. Put the fucking ring back on, now! Fuck you! <laughs> and if he lays a hand on you, I'll do what I do best. There, Cindy. Don't move. Oh, great. No. The safety was on, dumbass. No. Oh. If you so much as look at her again, I'm coming back here to finish the job. Hey, do you have any... I'll get it myself. Ugh. Hey, wait! What's your name? Adelaide. Adelaide Long. You saved my life. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> 